Well, welcome again to the European International Cup, this pre-season tournament. We are at the second match stage for you. Well, obviously the players aren't fully match fit, but uh, under the spotlight of the cameras and a lot of supporters, you're expected to put in a good performance, and it's not always easy. And this match features Borussia Dortmund against Porto. He's won, I know Alan's keeping an eye on here. Well, he's a crowd pleaser because when he gets the ball, you just don't know what's going to happen. So many possibilities with him in possession. Such a historic ground, Anfield, and of course made bigger in the last couple of years with this big stand which we broadcast from. Yeah, and I think it was a thoughtful addition to this ground because they've managed to retain the atmosphere, obviously add a few thousand uh, fans into the bargain. This is the Borussia Dortmund lineup. I think that back four is really important for them. They've got to be strong and solid, but they've got a bit of protection, haven't they? He's given the free kick, but no sign of the card. Maybe he just wants to make sure he's not made a rod for his own back with an early booking. Delivered into the box. Cleared away by the defender. Philip. And there is some backup for him in this position. Rahimi. And it's with Danilo. Alex Teles. Here's uh, Danilo Pereira. Now they're looking to get forward from this position. Rahimi. Wolf. Plenty of width for Dortmund now. Now, can he take them on? The chance to play on by the referee. He's got it away. Referee's officiating properly here within the laws of the game. Quite entitled to give that as a free kick. Well, early, sometimes the players expect to get away with it, I think. He's normally good from these set plays, and uh, his teammates are expecting a good ball in. Defended well. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. And shoots! And that's stopped easily by Ike Casillas. Being closed down. Corona. Just working away to try and find an opening. Corona. Abu Bakr. The shot's on! The chance did open up for that kind of shot. Well, if you don't have a go. Peace check. Wolf. Superb individual skill. Oh, see you later. Borussia Dortmund can get on the ball now in a wide position. Cleared away, well away from goal. And now the shot. He's had a real go. It's a decent effort, that, with plenty of sting in it. Yeah, not far away. He really did visit, didn't he? Hector Herrera. Alex Teles. Brahimi. Abu Bakr. Now Danilo Pereira. That's good movement forward here. It's given away. Larson. Delaney, and they've spread it out wide here, going forward well. That whipped him ball at the near post. Strong challenge.
quick-witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there with good vision to finish it off great reach and a great catch by the goalkeeper played into the middle by Piszczek and he's trying to get it away Striding forward, purposefully. A space to get the cross in. This with a chance to go into the lead now. Love to be a throw. Peace check. Here's a chance to whip it in. Thought they were in to score there. Rahimi. Tight scenario here on the ball. He's got some room out here in the wide position. Lost his man. Delivered into the box. Well, oh, that's good defending. Philip. Larson. Delaney. Now it's Ashraf Hakimi. A timely challenge. Corona. Can really get at the opposition here. Delaney. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away. Larson trying to find an opening, not panicking, and shoots! That's a good block. Must take the lead here. No, he's missed it. How is this still level? Oh, you'll be thinking about that one, tossing and turning in bed tonight. That was a bad miss. And the time to be added on here is a minimum of three minutes. Three minutes of added time. Abu Bakr. Rahimi. It's a good cross. Got it in. And goodness me, that smash and grab. That was against the balance of the play that we've seen so far. It doesn't matter how many chances, as long as you take a chance. And they've done that here. Well, they were caught out here by this quick counter-attack against the run of play. Yeah, I mean, they had to uh, stick together there and come under a lot of pressure, but with the pace in the team, that was always likely. Well, it's been tight before that goal, but now the manager, he's so pleased because I reckon he feels his team can go on and win this. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Well, the referee has signaled for half-time, and it's 1-0 here. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Oh, it's good first-half performance from him, and not just with the late goal, which was really important to get his team ahead, but everything he did was nice and sharp. Porto have the lead as we start the second half. Hector Herrera. And for goal! You can see the deflection there, corner. And in it goes. Kept his concentration, the goalkeeper, and because of that, kept hold of the ball. Yeah, he seems to fill the goal, this lad. He's quite an imposing keeper. But the space to go forward into with the ball. Saw the goal and went for it. And 
Porto awarded the corner. And here comes the corner. Cleared away by the defender. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. Hakimi. There's no doubt that around the bush telegraph, that's a free kick. That's a poor challenge, isn't it? And the card's coming out. Yeah, sometimes you wonder, is it a booking or not? I think we all thought, yes, he's going to get the yellow card, as he does. Genuine attempt to go for the ball? Yeah, it was a, a forwards tackle in many ways, a poor one. Larson. Delaney. Hakimi. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. They can spread the play now. Chance to cross it. You can see what he was trying to do with the cross, but it's a goal kick. Well, the manager not wasting any time here. He's going to make the change, and they are going to try and turn this around. Felipe. Corona. Opportunity in a wider area. Now, can he take them off? Very straightforward piece of goalkeeping as he catches the cross. Well, we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes. Half an hour to go. Good cross, this one from Piszczek. Defended well. Corona. Danilo Pereira. Brahimi. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. And that's dealt with the problem. Intercepted well. And now the shot. Corner for Porto. Well, there's going to be an alteration now. And with the team trailing, you can understand why he's going to make it. Substitution for the visitors. Coming off the pitch, number 22, Daniel Pereira. Coming onto the pitch, number 10, Oliver Torres. Put the corner in the middle. Great chance to get a greater hold on the game. They might just live to regret that miss. Peace check. Hakimi. Larson. Philip. Good vision. Great chance for Royce. Royce! Goalkeeper can... Oh, it's a brilliant volley. It deserved better. Just clipping the frame of the goal. Oh, the crowd enjoyed that one on the feet. I think he thought he'd scored with it. Activity on the bench for the losing team. A substitute getting ready to come on. Felipe. And 20 minutes to go. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Not rushing it here. Moving from one side to the other. Well, he has cleared the danger.
Mario Goetze. Axel Witzel. Larsen. The referee is awarded this free kick. Corona. On to the attack now. Wolf. Delaney. Marco Royce. Well, the Dortmund fans realise there isn't much time left now. Can really get at the opposition here. Delaney. He can lay it off to the supporting player. Looking to use the full width of the pitch in this attack. It's not a cross that's caused the defence any problems, and certainly not the goalkeeper. Well, Porto fans will be very pleased with this because there have been no anxieties for the team. They have been the top dog in this match and it's just been a case of the margin of victory really still a few minutes left probing pass from marco royce royce and it's in by the post well it swerved a bit at the end it might have been going wide initially but it's hit the inside of the post into the back of the net yeah, and when you do hit them with that kind of accuracy there's just no chance for the goalkeeper no chance at all So, away we go at one all. Corona. Soars. Well, there's going to be a substitution now. Room for the cross. Well, they kept up the pressure, didn't they? But it's finally been stopped now. It's going to be a big end to this game, isn't it? Will we get a decisive goal? Of an incisive pass. Played in the clear. It's a deep cross towards the back post. Put away, but not out of harm's way. He's not let his concentration dip late into this game with that interception. Keeps his team very much in the game. The score's still level. Mario Goetze. Larsen. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Good defensive clearance there. The fourth official has indicated three minutes. That that's what's minute going to be played for added time. Added time. Corona. They're looking for a winner still as the clock runs down. Oh, chance burned. What a position they got themselves into there. Wolf. That's it, the referee is blown. Final whistle, and we finish level. All credit to everyone involved here. The game could have been called off, really. They played it, and aren't we glad they did? Yeah, the weather was poor, but the pitch was good, and the play was even better. Marco Royce, very much in our minds going into the game. Alan, how do you think he did? Now we're at the final whistle. Yeah, that might turn out to be a really important equalising goal to get his team a draw, but... Had another, couldn't he? When he hit the woodwork.